Hello ladies and gentlemen and as always thank you for watching. This day has been a long time coming. We have made the drive to Tennessee to pick up this. Brand new 2024 Western Star 49X with a Century 9055XL wrecker body. 50 ton extended length. Whew, got a lot to show you all but right now we're getting to the dealership kind of late we got to take care of some paperwork this is going to be a monster this will be an excellent excellent workhorse all right go ahead and take care of some paperwork and then get ready for the drive back all right ladies and gentlemen so i'm on my way home with the truck uh, so far it has been an absolute dream to drive uh, there's I still got to get used to the controls and uh, certainly got to get used to the uh, Phoenix controls we'll talk more about that when I go through the walk around uh, but there's a little surprise in store Ethan and the crew are still working at the shop they're still working late it's going to be a little after 9 o'clock uh, before I get back to the shop. Uh, Mom and LaDonna are following me. They, they drove me down and then uh, they're following me. Uh, but I've had this planned ever since we ordered this truck. Ethan has never seen the driver's side door of this truck. And he has pestered me and pestered me and pestered me and pestered grandma and <laughs> uh, he has never had his name on a truck the very first truck we had was miss lauren named after my daughter uh, the current uh, red and white western star the v70 uh, had dad's name on the driver's door. The rotator number 11 has my name on the driver's door. And now this one, number 18, Ethan does not know it, but he's gonna find out in a couple of hours that his name is on the driver's door of this truck. Be, uh, I can't wait to see his reaction. This truck is just fantastic. I mean, I can't can't wait to use it. Uh, just driving it so far has been a dream. But uh, anyway, I can't wait to see his reaction. It's going to be. Hopefully, I can catch it on video. Uh, whenever he sees his name on the door, because he just called a while ago and wanted to know, am I going to get my name on the door of that truck? <laughs> So I thought I'd hop on here and mention that and uh, put it in the video because that's going to be that's going to be pretty awesome, uh, or at least I think it is. Anyway, two hours until I make it home. Here we go.
that's going to get some attention hello ladies and gentlemen and as always thank you for watching this has been a long time in the works just a quick quick run around of our new unit number 18 it is a 2024 western star 49x with a miller industries century 9055 xl which is a 50 ton extra long boom three stages with the coach low rider under reach which means it's low profile extra long built to uh, uh, do low picks haven't uh, haven't used it much yet we're still getting it set up I will go through more detail uh, as we get it set up just gonna give you a general walk around right now while it's nice and clean because it's supposed to rain tomorrow we just took possession of it uh, it took a little longer than we thought because we ended up having Phoenix lighting package installed which is not standard for Miller Industries. I will show you all that because it allows us the opportunity to go between uh, amber, amber white, red and blue. Uh, with the flip of a switch or the touch of a button, we can change all that and I'll do that in another video, but just a quick walk around. Uh, again, it's a 2024 Western Star 49X with a Cummins ISX and an 18 speed transmission. Standard fork holders on one side, small tunnel box. We do have some wood blocks. Like I said, we're still getting it set up. We don't have everything in here yet. Uh, we already had the heavy duty tire lift which will be put in here. They went ahead and put the mounting brackets in, but we had an extra tire lift here. The strap kits. Some respirators, end caps. There's the wheel lift tie downs. I don't think there's anything, oh, no, sorry, there is. There's the uh, light bar, remote light bar. All of these handles, I'll show you at night too, all of these handles are backlit, which is really cool. The control panel's backlit. Uh, this thing's got multifunction remote control, which again, I'll show you in a different video. Probably make a better video at night, but while it's pretty and sunshiny, not raining, like I said, I will show you the outside. Um, has extendable, short extendable outriggers on the rear. Has dual air reels. One for the emergency side, one for the service side. Has the newer style McKissick 12 ton snatch blocks. We have four of those. Has two winches on it. Um, another control panel here. This one has, which I wish our other trucks had, has a power inverter. And there's one of the uh, shore power lines, has another one in the cab so that you can charge like wireless tools, batteries and stuff, or run other things off of it. Standard shackle kit that comes with the heavies. Uh, haven't got this unboxed and set together yet, but that is the brake buddy or what used to be called the brake buddy. Twelve inch by twenty six and twelve inch by twenty web slings uh, for heavy recovery, and then the uh, clevis shackles for those, and a toolbox, which is amazing. We've got a few things put in here, just enough to get us by for now until we get uh, get everything else set. Again, just a quick walk around. Uh, Standard chain box, except we've added a few things. We added a couple of extra snatch blocks, added the rim slings, the uh, chain holder, or shoot, sorry, the axle 
chains for rear toes when you tie up the front axle. Uh, tie down chains did not come with. Did come with the Miller grab. Frame grab chains, my favorite go-to on the rotator. Uh, but I have the uh, 5 8 and the 3 quarter rim slings that we added. And it has air hose, more air hose, a couple of your standard couplers. Uh, this is for an international, that's for a Packard. Uh, fifth wheel, another uh, kingpin hookup. We've already put a sledge, shovel. We need a broom yet. Uh, big pry bar. Still some things we have to add to it. Uh, there is the Phoenix torch light, which is a extendable scene work light. New custom graphic design. Made by Dendy Hill. Down around Chattanooga, I'm not sure exactly what the city is, but they came up with that design and we were thoroughly pleased with it. She's an absolute dream to drive. I never thought I'd say it, but uh, I like it. I like it a lot. Didn't think a Western Star would ride that well, but it does. She rides and drives beautifully especially for a heavy, heavy truck. This will fill a gap that has been much needed for a long time here. Give us some time to uh, uh, give the old Western Star a rest. We are keeping the old Western Star. We're probably gonna refurbish it a little bit at a time, give it some TLC. Anyway, uh, as I said, I'll give you some more as we go and you'll get to see it in use, hopefully really, really soon. But for now, as always, thank you for watching and God bless.